Hey guys, it's your girl Asia Wasia, and I'm back today. Merry Christmas! It's Christmas, and hopefully, I could um update. I mean, not update, but upload this video tonight. But I'm currently out right now with my friend. Uh, we dropping off her gifts and stuff. She had to drop off like she had to drop off a few. But I'm taking her around doing that right now. Um, I'm trying to get used to this color hair on me because mm, I don't wear color. So it's like, it's kind of different for me. I don't know. Let me know. Let me, let me know what y'all think like in the comments. Do y'all like it? Because usually I just do black. And sometimes like I've had blonde before but not blonde braids. I've never done colored braids this is my very first time and so when i did blonde i actually had um what was it a blonde frontal and also i'm thinking about getting my nose pierced could y'all see me with that i think i can see myself with it but i'm kind of scared i got my first tattoo in september i don't know why this i'm all off topic but i'm bored and i just wanted to talk so, I got my first tattoo in September. Everybody was telling me that it was going to hurt, but it did not hurt. So, now I kind of want a nose ring. But a lot, like like every girl that I've asked about the nose piercing, they're like, um, it hurt real bad. And I ain't got time. But I really do want it. Like, I want it super, super bad. So, I might still end up getting it. But, I have not vlogged all day. I'm only starting now because I just thought about it. I need to be consistent. And I ain't being consistent. So, yeah. My friend coming right now. Because I see her walking. And so, I guess I'll vlog later. If we go out or if we do something. I'll let you guys know. Hey guys. I'm back. And, um. So, I'm gonna do a. Q&A. Just because. Um, it'll help answer questions about me and that some of you guys already asked so we finna get into this and by the way I'm not answering all of these questions cause y'all was asking some some little crazy stuff <laughs> like crazy stuff but I'm gonna answer like most of them I got like 25 questions wrote down and um yeah we're gonna get straight into this video okay so the first question that you guys asked was i guess we okay some of these questions are a little bit spicy mind you i did not um i didn't put the questions in order so it's gonna be some calm questions and then some crazy questions some little spicy questions the first question is um when is the last time i kissed and the last time i kissed was actually today on christmas so yeah last time i kissed um the second question is how's college going okay so college is going pretty good um i actually love college i'm ready to go back because i miss all of my friends like oh my god it's been so boring. I hate coming home, y'all. I try my best to, like, avoid coming home just because, like, I don't really mess with nobody down here. So, it's kind of like, I'd be, like, a little loner in my own world, just vibing. And it ain't nothing wrong with that, but it's just a simple fact that I want to be, you know, lit with my friends. But, actually, one of my babes came to see me. Her name is Janaya. And, um... We had a fun time. We made the sugar cookies. She was actually the one in my first vlog when we made the little sugar cookies or whatever. If y'all haven't seen the video, make sure to go check it out. I'm going to link it in the description box below. And um, like that for me. Um, Yeah. College is like, it's lit. <laughs> and actually, I'm working on something big right now. Me and one of my friends, actually, we both working on something big. So, fingers crossed we get that out the way because if we get that out the way y'all i'm gonna be so happy and proud of myself but anyways 
Next question. Would I date a girl? Yes. But I wouldn't date like... Well, I'm not going to say I wouldn't date. But see, me personally, I'm not attracted to like girly girls, if that makes sense. Like, you know how it's like you got your studs, your films, then your masculine females. I think I'm more attracted to girls that are like studs. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I would date a girl. When am I giving you guys a mukbang? Um, see, okay, so I love seafood. So, probably my next time that I get seafood, I'll give you guys a mukbang. And then I'll ask y'all to, um, like, what type of story time y'all want me to tell while I'm doing the mukbang. So, I can have something to talk about. And so, yeah. And with the mukbang, I'm not going to make y'all wait, like, too long. Because I'm trying to post, like, constantly. Like, you know, trying to get the feel of posting, like, a lot. So, I won't get out track and be like, forget this. Because I really do want to blow. So, happy girl out. Okay? Okay? Okay. So, my next question is, what is my biggest fear? Well, I kind of, like, I kind of already experienced it. But my biggest fear... No, nah, I... Hold on, hold on. I experienced it, but not what I'm about to say. Because I ain't experienced it. So, my biggest fear would be losing my mama. But I say I kind of already experienced it, it. Because, like, if you know me, you know that I lost my 14-year-old sister last year. um, In September. Like, this last past September. I lost her. And that hurt me so bad. But, yeah. So, my biggest fear would be um definitely losing my mama. Just because me and my mama, we, like, so close. And, like, she kind of like my sister. Like, we grew up together. I'm an only child. And, like, that's my baby. I'm her baby. Y'all, she still call me a baby. And I'm not no baby. I'm grown. <laughs> but, yeah, she, um, that's my biggest fear. Losing my mom. Hope to God it never happens. Even though I know it's going to happen. But just not no time soon. Let her live to be 834. No, I'm just kidding. But let her live, like, a long and healthy life. Let her get old. Um, what are my life goals? I'm going to name three. So, my first life goal, like, overall in life is to be successful. That's my first one. My second one is to be happy. And my third one is to be at peace. <laughs> I know y'all probably, like, lay. But, yeah, no, for real. Like, do my three life goals because you need that in life. Uh, what is my, what is your favorite hookup? What? Y'all asking me, like, what was my favorite sticky leak? I, I think, I think that's what you asking. What is your favorite hookup? No, 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 okay, no, yeah, she did say, she said, who is your favorite hookup? I'm sorry, y'all. She said, who is your favorite hookup? Okay, so. I'm not going to say too much, but my favorite sneaky link was this one that I met at college. And, um, I'm a, I'm a, because people don't know, like, y'all don't know. But if he see this video, he going to know that I'm talking about him. But my favorite sneaky link, this is the only hit I'm going to give y'all. He from Louisiana. <laughs> he from Louisiana. That's my favorite sneaky link. I'm sorry. But, um, okay. Next. Would you ever take your ex back? Ever. Never. Never. Okay. Next. My next question is, worst head that I've gotten? Okay, so this is going to be like a little mini story time. All right, let me think. I don't think I really just... No, I just had to get... Okay, so... This was like... This actually happened this year. So, I met this boy, right? He was from the A, which is, like, surprising because... Well, I mean, I guess it's not surprising, but... I'm trying to make sure I read this question right before I, you know... Where's he? You got in here. Yeah. Okay, so, yeah, it was like, I don't know how to explain it, but he didn't know what he was doing with the tongue, like, 
I don't know what he had going on, but he went munching how he was supposed to be munching. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna get in too much detail because it's kind of weird to talk about. I feel like I'm not that comfortable enough to talk about stuff like that. But yeah, uh, how many kids do I want in the future? So I want two kids. I've always wanted two kids. More than likely, I would want a boy and I would want a girl. I used to care which one would come first, but now it's like, I don't really care which one comes first. Because it's like, it really don't make a difference. You know how people be like, no, the boy should come first before, because um they can protect the sister or whatever. Whatever. If he come first, he come first. If he comes second, he comes second. He's still going to protect his sister. It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I want two kids, a boy and a girl. But I would be um I would be happy with also um getting a girl and a girl or a boy and a boy. Well, I don't know about a boy and a boy, because boys are rough. Like they is some serious. So but I wouldn't mind having twins, like a girl and girl, like two identical twins or whatever. Yeah, I wouldn't mind having those too. Um What's your dream man? So my ideal dream man would be okay super super dark skin when i say dark skin i mean like black like this shirt black i love chocolate skin y'all like it's just something about chocolate skin like it's not it's nothing wrong with brown skin you know it's nothing wrong with any type of skin color but that's what attracts me i love chocolate skin so he would have to be very, very dark. Teeth, straight teeth, like, you know, good smile. Um, I could go for locks, like you can have locks or you can have like a, you could go, you can have waves or like a low cut as well. I like those hairstyles. Um, height wise, you would have to at least be like six feet. I'm five five by the way, not that tall. Um, but yeah, I love tall. Like, I love a tree. I love a tree. So yeah, you have to be like six feet and up. Um, body wise, okay. So you can, you can have. Okay, so I I would love to have you know somebody that's fit and that got like a six pack or whatever. But I'm not just picky picky. Like I'm not just you know. Like, okay, if you don't got a six pack, I'm not going with you. You can have a pot belly, just a small one, just a small one, but yeah, the six packs and the pot belly. Mm -hmm. And then let's see, also, you gotta know how to dress, you gotta know how to put the stuff on, you know what I'm saying? Can't be out here looking crazy, not with me, mm -mm. can't be out here looking crazy, not going. And let's see, I'm not very, very picky. Oh. And I need you to not lie to me. Always be honest, because that's a big thing for me. I always like honesty. Um, and I think that's about it. You ain't got to do too much, you know. And I'm pretty sure I probably just described a whole bunch of you boys or whatever. But, yeah. Okay. What is a goal you have yet to accomplish? A goal for myself that I have yet to accomplish is... Y'all probably laugh, but getting a job. <laughs> Just because, like, okay, so I've had plenty of jobs. Plenty of jobs. But it's like, if I feel like the manager got me feeling some type of way, like, if you got me being, oh, baby, bye, I'm gone. It's just like, I don't tolerate disrespect from nobody. It don't matter who you is. It's always another job, and I know I shouldn't think like that. I'm going to stop thinking like that because the next job that I get, I'm going to try my very, very best to, like, work there for, like, a little minute. You know what I'm saying? Just because um, I need to break that habit of, like, okay, you get an attitude with me, I'm going to get an attitude with you, and I'm going to quit on you. I'm not going to – I'm going to try to stop doing that. You know what I'm saying? So my goal that I have yet to accomplish is, like, getting a job and sticking with that job. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. The next one is – um, what's something you wanted to do but never had the time, bro? Skydiving. I love like, you know, the rush, like and having adrenaline and doing stuff like that. So I really like every time I go to like Atlanta, 
I be wanting to skydive. And they got, this, they got this little thing in Atlanta called iFly. If anybody ever been, please let me know how the experience was because I really, really want to check that out. But, yeah, it's a thing called skydive. I mean, iFly. But that's not like skydiving. Like, I really want to, like, jump out of a plane. You know what I'm saying? Like, get the parachutes or whatever, jump out of a plane, actual skydiving. And if y'all know any places that do that, like around Georgia, probably nowhere but Atlanta probably, but I don't mind going to Atlanta. Let me know because I really want to do that. This like, this probably like my number one top priority or something that I want to do but have not done yet. Okay, let's see. The next one is where do I live? Okay, so I'm currently a college student, so I stay in um. Yeah. I stay in Carrollton, my bad. Y'all had to think, like, yeah. I stay in Carrollton, Georgia, currently, because I'm a college student. I am from West Point. Y'all probably don't know what that is. It's a very small country town. Uh, and I say I'm from there because I've been living there for so long. But if I tell y'all where, re where I'm really from, y'all could be like, girl, what is that? Because on the map, y'all, my pop that population, like, where I'm from, is probably, like, 900 people in that city like i swear it's so small we got one grocery store and it's piggly wiggly on the grocery store we got like two places to eat it's like subway and beachy but the beach it burned down so it's only really a subway and then the gas station pizza gas station pizza busted too by the way but yeah that's where i live currently Carrollton, georgia um let's see what is my name? My name is Alasia. If you guys didn't know, yeah, I'm Alasia. Hey. And then the next question is, what are my socials? So all of my social media is the same except for my Facebook. So my Instagram, my Snapchat, my TikTok, and um, I don't. I mean, I got a Twitter, but I'm not on it, so I'm not gonna tell y'all it because I. I seriously do not be on it. Like, that's the that's I I need to delete it because I don't be on it. But all three of those are Lasia Wasia, and um, if you don't know how to spell it, um, you can literally look on my YouTube and it's spelled everywhere on there, even like in the little description box. So yeah, look at that. And then my Facebook is just my name. It's Alasia Parks. A L A I S A P A R K S Parks. Alasia Parks. So make sure y'all go follow me like it whatever y'all want to do um next question am i in a relationship no <laughs> i'm not in a relationship i'm single and i have been single for a year now a whole year yeah i've been single for a whole year and um and it was i guess it was like a part two or whatever it says are you looking like, are you interested in anyone? I'm not interested in anyone, but I'm open to, like, you know, talking to people or whatever. I don't know. I'm crazy. Just so I'm not in a relationship, if y'all want to. <laughs> for real. For real. Like, I'm not playing. I'm really crazy. Okay. Next question. Do I drink? So, funny. I never drunk before until I went to college, y'all. Like, bad influences i let that peer pressure get to me <laughs> because like like people like if you know me you know like i don't do nothing like y'all lame i go to parties or whatever but i'm not drinking well i used to not now i'm not gonna say that i just do it but it's like if i'm out at a party and then my friends be like y'all want to get drinks and i'm like okay cool sure let's do it you know what i'm saying but i don't drink like heavy liquor you know what I'm saying like Hennessy, Patron Douce all that type of stuff I'm not with all that give me some margarita give me a little you know what I'm saying give me something that's like not strong but like I like juice flavor I don't like all that strong hard stuff I'm not with all that yet next question do I smoke I do not smoke and I honestly don't think that I ever will smoke. I mean, drinking, I just wanted to, like, you know, try it out or whatever. Um, just to see. 
And I mean, I mean, I guess you could do the same thing for smoking, but me personally, I don't find that attractive for me. It's nothing wrong with it. Like, it's okay for girls to do it, and it's okay for dudes to do it. But me personally, I don't think I look good doing that. Plus, I love the color of my lips. Pretty. And um, so I don't want to, you know, because people be like, when you smoke, it turns your lips black or whatever. I'm not trying to get into all of that. <laughs> but yeah, no, I don't smoke. Um... It says my first time having, you know, doing the do. I'm not going to answer that. I would do a whole story time on that if you guys would like. Just let me know. But I'm going to skip that one and go to the next one, which is um, my three biggest pet peeves, which would have to be lying for sure. Lying for sure would be the number one biggest pet peeve. It's just something about a liar. Like, what make you just sit there and let them words come out your mouth knowing that you lie? That's, that's my biggest pet peeve. And that's the quickest way to get cut off. Like, if you're talking to me and we got any communications going, you lie to me, you out of there, cut, gone, blocked, deleted, everything. I hate a lie. My second one would be um, being dirty. I don't know. I don't, I don't consider myself as, like, like, I don't got OCD or nothing, but I consider myself as a clean freak. I love, like, clean stuff. And if I, like, just see that you dirty, that's a wrap. That's an automatically no. Mm -mm. And then my third biggest pet peeve would be, um, let's see. Something I hate. Okay, so I hate when, like, Okay, say for instance, if you're talking to a dude, right? And then, like I said, talking to a dude. And y'all establish that y'all are in the talking stage to where y'all are not talking to other people, right? And then you find out that that's still talking to other people while you done cut everybody else off. I I don't like that. That's another, that's, that's the last pet peeve that I got. I mean, I got plenty more, but those probably are like the three biggest ones. And then the last question that I have is favorite song at the moment. I would say, um, I don't know, probably, I'm trying to think, because I would say I got like two. Um, so Baby Drill, Mr. C B F W. Y'all know what that stands for. I'm not trying to really cuss on here because I think it can get demonetized and I'm try not trying to do that. And then my second one would probably be by Glow uh, tomorrow. Because that's hard. But she say every day the sun will shine. But that's why I love tomorrow. <laughs> but yeah, um, that was the little Q&A or whatever. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm so sorry about that first video that it was three minutes. Y'all, that was my first. I didn't know what I was doing. And then when I seen that people was really liking me, and that was like, Lay, I really wanted to watch you. That was like, girl, you gave me a three-minute video, three minute video. I was like, y'all, I'm sorry. I didn't know. Like, I got to get I gotta get used to this. I got to learn what to do and what not to do. So bear with me. At least I made it to 20 minutes. Hmm. Proud of me. But yeah, uh, I think I'm going to end this video off. And I really do hope you guys enjoyed the Q&A. And if you have any more questions, like if y'all want me to answer a few uh, um, other questions, just let me know. You can, I do like polls on my Instagrams and Snapchats. And like I ask you guys to like ask me questions. And then I probably, next time I probably do like a story time or something. But um, yeah. So I'm gonna go go ahead. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. So could you guys please like this video, subscribe to my channel, turn that post notification bell on so you guys can see whenever I upload a video, and um, comment and share my YouTube videos as well if you guys don't mind. You know, helping me out. But yeah, guys, that's all for this video, and I hope you guys stay blessed. Bye.